Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we are here for our Rocket League episode of UFC season. We're here for episode number six of Push to the Playoffs. And right now we're in a good spot to make the playoffs. In the last episode, we kind of got our rhythm back. Uh, two episodes ago we beat the Skyhawks. We got our rhythm back against the Guardians and against the Bombers. Winning three crucial matches um, at the start of the season. We won three matches in the first episode, and then we took on the Guardians, Bombers, and the Dragons, and that was our first loss. We were 5-1. and one. Then, we took on the Seekers, and we're 6-1. and one, Feeling in a good spot. But, then, we went and lost four in a row. So, it took a little bit out of us, right? We were in such a good spot. Again, Six and one, six and two, six and three, six and four, six and five. Like it was like, oh my god, how do we go from five and zero oh to six and five? It was terrible. Uh, last again, last episode though, we got some of that back. Dragons, we did lose one zero. Was that the first time we didn't score a goal? Yes, that was the first game so far. That we did not score a goal. Let's take on the Seekers. Um, so, the Seekers and Mammoths have an outside shot to make the playoffs. They have to win every game. Uh, the big battle is the Skyhawks. Can they make it in? Um, we don't get to face them, so it doesn't matter. And the Guardians, 6-9. and nine, They kind of fell off a little bit. They were like 6-6. Six and six, um, I think after we beat them. They fell off a little bit. Uh, so right now, 9-6. and six. A win here. Mathematically puts us in, especially with the Skyhawks. If they lose, uh, Skyhawks and Rebels can basically hurt each other. So we're in a good spot. Basically... We need to win one of the next three, and we're, we're in a real good spot. But let's see what we can do. Whoever gets the 5 and 10 team, this should help us. Hopefully, we can win here and get to 10 wins. Like I said um, in one of the previous episodes, looking at the Dragons, they hit 10 wins. Um, I think when you hit 10 wins... You're pretty much going to make the playoffs. The key thing for us is keeping that two seed. Um, that gives us a buy in the next episode. Um, the one and the two seed don't have to play as many games when you do the 16 playoff. Uh, when you do the four team playoff, everybody plays. Uh, Nobody has a buy, obviously. So when you do a, damn, how'd you miss that? When you do a playoff format, the we're doing it. The top two teams get a buy. So I like that. I like to have a buy. You know, put us on a shot to have to go up against one team to make the championship. Um, so I'd like to not drop down below. Uh, the second seed. We've kind of been the second seed the whole time. I don't think we fell below it. We might have been one of our losing streaks. We might have fell to third for a second uh, before we got back to winning. But I was kind of frustrated in that video. Skipped through the, the menu of that, if I'm honest. Again, the only game we've not scored a goal in uh, so far is that loss against the Dragons. Um, every other game we have scored at least once. So. Of 
scores. This game, if we want to win, we gotta score at least twice. Again, the Seekers are not by any means out of playoff contention, even though they're five and ten. They're only two games behind two teams that are taking on each other at this current moment, so a win for them is big. A loss for us could be problematic. Again, we need one win guaranteeably in this episode to make the playoffs. little bit off. Game just... I don't know what's been going on, but we just haven't played our best. I mean, generally, nobody has, so not one person not playing well. This team hasn't played well. That'd have been nice before we were down uh, by two. See if we can make something magical happen here. Hitting it that way is not going to really help us, though. Yeah, hitting it into the corner of our side doesn't help. So. Seekers are still in it. Uh, Mammoths are five and eleven. Still technically in it. Um, goal differential for us is twenty-two, so we've evened our goals out uh, with the Dragons. They've actually overtaken us. Far and away, the best two teams. Um, Yeah, let's take on the Cyclones. Uh, they don't have nearly as good of a goal differential as we do. Um, so, hopefully we can beat them. Last time we took on the Cyclones, we lost 2-4. to four. So, let's see what we got.
Ah, if I was a little higher up, that'd be good. This is a team that we want to beat. Obviously, both nine and seven. This is the team that really is going to determine, or this matchup is going to determine which one of these two teams is the second seed in the playoffs. Oh, why'd you hit it to the side? Like, stop fucking clearing their goals, dude. That's obnoxious. Like, I don't know if I would have got to it, but I would nice to at least have a shot. There we go, punch that in. That was turning. I was a little worried. I could have bounced off that wall just a little bit better. Because I hit that shit very hard against the wall. That's not set up terribly. That is not set up terribly. It's not necessarily necessarily where I wanted to go with the ball. Ah, damn. I'd have enjoyed that goal very much. Oh no way, dude. You're fucking kidding me. 14 seconds from the finish of this game. And they score a goddamn goal. Why'd you do that? All right, next goal wins this bitch.
and realistically, the number two seed in the playoffs. Oh, I missed that, bruh. There ain't no way. a little bit more boost we could have got there. Thank you. All right, that's brilliant. Ten and seven. Again, only team mathematically eliminated is the Mammoths. Actually, they're not, because they can have five, six. No, they'd have seven, yeah. So the Mammoths are mathematically eliminated, and we... Uh, my favorite thing in this game, gold differential. We'll secure that second seat, because no matter what, nobody can surpass the gold differential that we have of 23. So dragons are one seed, we're the two seed. Anything else is open in the air. Um, bombers and cyclones also make the playoffs, as the worst they can do is 9 and 9. Um... So, yeah, they'll make the playoffs because nobody can really beat them out of it. Especially the Bombers, they should be good. Uh, Cyclones are good as well. So, let's play final match against the Rovers. Can we want to get a win? Carry that momentum here into the playoffs. And then we'll see. In just probably five minutes from now, how the playoffs will go. This is the team that we lost to previously. Um, that win against the Cyclones was big, big, big. Ah, damn. And this does not really matter, this game. So, again, beating the Cyclones is really what mattered. Uh, and obviously, I want to win it. Like, don't get me wrong. I want to win every game, but yeah. Can I just forfeit the match and be done? Oh god. This is not a Great last match. Can you stop hitting?
Ah, oh, damn. We get one on the board here. Please, thank you. Can I let you just get... Get one on the board? We've had all the one match that we scored in, so... You know, getting a goal on the board is a goal of mine, no matter the total outcome of this game right now. So... See we can do. Damn. This is potentially a team that we have to face again, so... Vertical somehow bounced off of their dude right in front of the goal, and their dude tried to block it and missed. Get blasted forward. Could have put us in a real shot for that. I was gonna do a flip forward, try and hit that in. It was not meant to be. So entering the playoffs here, we will be uh, 10 and 8. Alright, Rover's got that W. First round of the playoffs complete already. Well, let's look at the standings here. I wish that the first round of the playoffs didn't just end. Because that kind of throws off where everybody's ranked. Uh, but, again, we got that one seed, Cyclones. Seekers made it in. That's interesting. Where were the Seekers? Wait, the Seekers made the playoffs? Bruh. When they beat us. They were five and ten. Wow. 
So six and ten, seven and ten, eight and ten. They made the playoffs eight and ten, beating out the Guardians and the Skyhawks. Uh, Rovers and Bombers made it in. Uh, Rovers took on the Cyclones. Seekers took on the Bombers. Seekers are now going to be playing against the Dragons. Uh, we get the Cyclones. And how have we fared against the Cyclones? 2-1 and one in Week 17. Of course, like I said, we probably would have to face them. And we have to face them again. Uh, but basically, winning that game against them prevented us from having to take on the Rovers. Um, and then the Dragons and the Seekers will face off. So, Seekers went all over a run. So, we'll see what happens in the next episode as we take on the Cyclones for the second episode in a row. In Cyclones, we lost them 2-4, to four, and they're the only team who went to overtime against 2-1. to one. So, we'll see you guys in the next one.